Well, today we're going to talk about the black woman. Mm. Once again, the black woman. Mm. Today's title is uh, um, The Caucasity of the Black Woman. The Caucasity. The Caucasity. And you know, that's, that's, uh, that's an interesting title because we're talking about the black woman mm -hmm. right. having the audacity to defend her slave master. Right. Mm. Although it's been instilled in her mm -hmm. since the days of Willie Lynch till now. Yeah. All right. But it's our it's our job as Israelite men, right, mm -hmm. to uh, cast down and every vain imagination and to mm -hmm. deconstruct the Willie Lynch. That's right. right. That's, That's inside right. of our sisters. That's and right. the sister that we're gonna talk about today mainly is your sister, Oprah. Right. Oprah. Oprah Winfrey. Oh, you got Oprah right. Winfrey, you got Stacey Dash, right, mm -hmm. and you have Candace Owens. Those three are gonna get it today. There's many yes. more. Right, but right. we're going to concentrate just on those three. All right. All right, go ahead, Officer Yaku. Bring us in. All right, so the first thing that we're going to go to is an article uh, that was spoken of about um, about Oprah. Mm -hmm. and, but it, it was funny because they were saying that Oprah is not the savior, and then the article goes into how black women have always kind of been used as saviors. Mm. Uh, so let's get that article on her, not this one. Well, save to save our yeah, that people. One, there, or, there we go. Yeah. Or to save other nations. Yeah, to save, no, the savior of, well, in the article, the way that it is written is savior of nations. Mm. That the black woman, woman really never should have even been put in a position to look like she was the savior of a nation. Mm. But that uh, America. Hey, not to cut you off, but your, your president. You. No, I know, nah, I know, nah, I know you not, voted yeah, for him. Nah. I know you voted for nah, him. Nah, man. Hey, <laughs> Obama said. If there was um, a female president in every country, the world would be better off. Wow. That's what Obama said. Right. That's what Obama said. And you know what's funny about that? You'll say that, and a lot of sisters, they'll really feel that, but they'll mm -hmm. just keep their mouth shut. But inside, deep inside, they feel deep inside that. the recesses of their brain, right. uh -huh. you know, they are thinking that they are better than the black man. Right. Mm. That's right. Mm. Right. Mm. That's why we're deconstructing that Willie Lynch is very important, brothers. Yep. That's right. But let's see what this article is talking about. So, America, Oprah is not your savior. Mm. America has a history of looking oh, to oh, black yeah, women. Yeah, you got to oh, read sir. that again. Yes, read sir. the title again. Put some power on that Come one. Come on. Put some power. Yes, sir. America. And bomb. Oprah is not your savior. Boom. And that's exactly what they're going to hear if they keep thinking Oprah's their savior. Right, that's right. You're going right. to hear a bomb. Go ahead. One more than one. Yeah. America has a history of looking to black women to save Americans from themselves mm. while not recognizing or respecting their efforts. So in the article, let's go, let's go down. We're going to hold on. Let go, me, go I got to go back up. Go back yeah. Up. Yeah. Go let's look at up. those Take signs. Your time. Brothers, I got to mm. be in the spirit when y'all back there in the mm. AV room. <laughs> Don't just be scrolling just to scroll. Look at, we have to examine these posters. Right. Wow. All right. So to the far left, yep. you have the sister right there and they're all sisters. Mm -hmm. And you, I think you got, yeah, they're all yeah. sisters. I don't see any Edomites hiding anywhere. Mm -hmm. What I see, I see Whoa. chocolate. I see chocolate covered Edomites. Mm -hmm. That's what I see at the forefront. Though. Look at the sister right there. Say her name. Is right. that talk? That's like that sounds like some Me Too stuff. Say her name. All right. If they talking about sisters being abducted and murdered wrongfully, right. then of course, all right. All praises for that. Yeah. But they got that thing right next to that LBD LBGTQ movement right. flag. Which is a big no no. What does LGBTQ stand for again? <clears throat> Lust uh -oh. guarantees a boot a booty tragedy quickly. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right. Hey, that was a beautiful that was a beautiful acronym yeah, by our bishop. And I love wow. that. <laughs> Lust <laughs> guarantees a booty tragedy quickly. That's oh, exactly yeah. what happens. <laughs> Y'all keep entertaining that lifestyle. The right. I said no, not to do it for a reason. That's but cool. look who's leading the charge. Right. Yep. Exactly. Look who's leading the charge. The hey. black woman has to spearhead. These things, why? Because the black man won't step up. Mm -hmm. That's a major problem. That is a major, major problem. Right. Hey, Captain, that imagery is heavy, too, because you see right in the middle in the back, yep. you see the brother behind the sisters. Right. Yep. Mm. He's just tagging along this? with it. Mm. That's it. Wow. Right. He can't say nothing. He's just tagging along. Yep. In, the, in the back of the line, when the women at the forefront of all this. Sheesh. And, and, and Esau will love to have it this way. Yeah, they will definitely. love to have it this way. Uh, I'm a huge fan of Oprah, but... I disagree with the masses who want her to run for president, not because she's a political amateur. So not because she's a political amateur, but because America has a history of looking to black women to save Americans from themselves. 
while not providing the proper recognition for their labor or even respect. John Dean, a White House White House counsel under Obama, tweeted an endorsement that sums this up. She could end Trump's and the GOP's misogyny and racism like no one else, he predicted, tagging his post, Oprah 2020. But why should the burden of cleaning up Trump's Trump's mess fall on a single black woman? America has always trusted black women to do the work, but it's always come at the expense of their well-being. You know what's mm. crazy? As you're reading this article, you don't hear anything about the black man. Right. That's a this nope. is a slap in the face. Right. We're not even considering you. We're right. looking at your woman. Yeah. Mm. They're always trying to put the woman ahead of the man. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. They mm -hmm. followed that Willie Lynch letter to a T. Uh -huh. To a T. Just, just. Since then, black women have been at the forefront of social movements in America. Hey, it says since then, black women have been at the forefront of social movements in. America. America. Hey, get me that prophecy in Jeremiah mm. 31. Give sure. me that prophecy, please. Jeremiah sure. 31. Because the Most High spoke it, and it came to pass. A lot of our brothers and sisters still believe that the white, the white man wrote this book, and this is a book of mythology. Jeremiah 31, 22. 22. Yes, sir. The book of Jeremiah, chapter 31 and verse 22. Come on. How long wilt thou go about, uh -huh. O thou backsliding daughter? For the Lord hath created a new thing in the earth. What's the new thing that the Most High created? A woman shall come past a man. And that's almost that's happening in almost every single way. Right. Every aspect of society, what that's you see right. is they're pushing the black woman ahead of the man. They're trying to create that imagery to put it out there right. that the black man is nothing. Mm. You know? So it's, it, it, that's, that's why we have a big job to do, a, right. a great job to do, man. Right. It's like you climbing a mountain. There's a damn avalanche, a mudslide going on, and you climbing that mountain. Right. That's why you black, we need you black sisters to get along with your husbands, exhort your husbands, exhort the black man. Because not right. only is he, he got to get himself right, he's against everything in society. Right. He's against everything in society, but then he got to come home and be at odds with you. The hell is this? The media, they throw, they throw, they threw everything at the black man except for the damn kitchen sink. Right. They probably already threw the kitchen sink at him, but we still standing. Right. That's right. That's like right. the like Thanos in um Avengers when mm -hmm. he when he threw the damn sun and the planets and the stars <laughs> right, at, right. at the Avengers. It's the that same thing with so-called black men. We right. see it, we read about it. Yeah, the yeah. black woman sees it and read about it, but she's still at odds with her man. Right. We, even with the people of her nation, like Oprah, she's right. not married, right? And no. Stacey Dash, she's married to Eda Mike, so right, is Candace right. Owen. But still, these are the these are the people that are they are at opposition with their own. Right. Mm. So the last thing we need is for the black woman to be against us. Now they will see the true men of God. We are not black men, we are the Israelites. Daniel of Israel United in Christ. Please subscribe to our YouTube channels. Stay up to date with our latest events, music, and classroom lessons. IUIC plans to continue visiting different countries where this gospel has not been preached before. IUIC needs your help in pushing this truth. So join us, 
subscribe to our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and podcasts, and stay up to date with us. For more information, please visit www.israelunite.org.